Rachel Smith, as you can see, I'm wearing three beanies, commonly referred to as the Smith Knit. I like to think that each beanie represents 10 years of your life, 20 if we're considering your liver. Listen, champion, a bunch of your nearest and dearest got together and wanted to celebrate you and 30 with a video tribute. So now that my head is profusely sweating, let's get right to it. And now, a day in the life of downtown Rachel. I don't need the fourth week of birth control pills or a phone app to tell me that my period is coming. If the sound of your breathing behind me in line at Starbucks makes me want to karate chop my own face off, then that's warning enough for me. Tag me in that pic! Wait, am I tan? Do I look tan? Hey Rachel, I got a little birthday confession for you. You know that piece of shit you found in your purse the other day? Yeah, that wasn't Felicity's. Thanks, bye! Hey Rach, happy 30th. I know it's important to you. Birthdays don't mean much to me. Um, I was going to do something funny, but i just been thinking about when I first met you, so I wrote down a bunch of stuff, and I typed it out so I could get through it. Um, some of it's kind of sentimental, so here we go. God damn it, Rosie! Hey, Rach, happy 30th. Uh, I know that most of the people here are giving you shit, talking bad about you, so I figured rather than do that, I'm going to show some of the things that I think you like as you've now turned into the 30-year-old you've become. So first, we're going to start with uh, money. I think, I think you like money? Well, I also think you're Jewish, so that's why you like money. Uh My name is Rachel. I really like to cuss. Don't care if your mom is on Facebook. I'm talking about my butt and, and my, my puss. Just in case you didn't know, I really like to drink. No wonder people think I'm crazy. Huey down at Toomey, he's my shrink. Shrink. But all in all, I have great friends and a family that can't compare. So thank you all for coming to my birthday. Watch out, 30 beware! Rachel Smith, quite frankly, the funniest bitch I know. When Rachel and I first met, we had the time of our lives. We partied, we drank, we danced, we laughed. And then we woke up the next morning and had zero idea. We met, we drank, we laughed. Nope, we definitely knew we drank because we had headaches. So there's really two fucking reasons why I love Rachel Smith. One is her love for Bette Midler. And the other is for her compassion for the AIDS epidemic. When I met Rachel in sophomore year of high school... She was this cute little fucking Jewish button. Had her hair all up in a bun with the little plastic butterflies that hold nothing up but are there for just the looks. Loved her in an instant. Her glorious khakis and white pumas. We had art class together. And we're sitting there, grouped up. We meet for the first time. And she and I have to paint each other's portraits. And the CB art teacher, Mr. McGovern, does his, okay, kids, let's uh, sit one across from the other. Paint looking into each other's eyes, but paint as if you're from a distance. And this fucking bitch, Rachel Smith, breaks out into song, looking deep into my eyes, going, from a distance. The world looks blue and green And the snow-capped mountains white From a distance the ocean meets the stream And she's painting And the eagle takes light my eyes fucking open wide and my mouth drops to the fucking floor and I say bitch I want to have your fucking babies and that was it that was it best friends ever since 
Oh my God, I am awake. Happy birthday, boo. Just wanted to say how grateful I am to have you in my life and how honored I am to call you my friend. You're beautiful, intelligent, witty, and funny as hell, and you always make everybody laugh. You're an incredible friend, a wonderful auntie, and I'm excited to be a part of tonight's celebration in your honor. So here's to you, gorgeous. Laheim. All right, take two. Um, Rachel, we can get through it this time. Uh, it's a little sentimental. Also, I wanted to let everyone here know that she only could invite about 100 people, so all of you that are here are really close to her. You invited her and I couldn't bring Karen. You know what, Rachel? Fuck you. Hey, Rach. Me again. In my constant pursuit to be as tan as you, and frankly, Jen Galenti, I have taken tanning to an extreme. Happy 30th, boo. So the other reason why I love Rachel Smith is because she's got such a deep fucking concern for the whole AIDS epidemic. You got people out there like Charlie Sheen, Magic Johnson, Pedro Zamora from the real world of San Francisco, all the poor people out there and the rich people here in the States, all who have AIDS. The truth is she doesn't give a shit about any of those people, but she does care about getting AIDS herself. We were driving this one time in a car and she was telling me that she actually denied getting some D. And I said, what? Rachel, why would you do such a thing? You need ass. You haven't gotten laid in like five years. What's wrong with you? She's like, dude, fool didn't have a condom. I said, hell no, no pee in the VG. I was like, okay, power too. But like, really, I mean, it's one time. It's just one time, a little slip and slide. Not gonna do anything. You're not gonna catch anything. She's like, oh, hell no. I don't wanna get AIDS. I'm terrified of AIDS. I said, Rachel, you're not gonna get fucking AIDS. And she literally stopped the car midway in the street. She looks at me dead in the eyes. She's like, boo, I've just seen Philadelphia way too many times. Happy birthday, Auntie Rachel. You're the beast. We love you. Happy birthday, Auntie Rachel. Happy birthday, Rachel. Now, even though I'm black and you're Jewish and I'm gay and you haven't decided if that's really what it's come down to yet, I really enjoy getting to know you. Happy 30th birthday. If it doesn't work out, we can have a time share book or a tone and I'll cook and you can drink. Happy birthday! Moving on. I know that your dad's a big fan and I think you are too. I know you love the Packers. Yeah, go Brett Favre, uh, Aaron Rodgers, all that good stuff. Uh, I know you like traveling. I know that because this hair would only show up on you on a plane. I don't know why you were on me and Sam's honeymoon, but you were. Anyway, Rachel Smith, one of my favorite people in the world. Happy 30th birthday. I absolutely adore you. Thank you so much for being such a wonderful friend to my husband and I. And thank you even more so for being such a great auntie to my daughter, Julia, and Felicity. I love you to bits, and you are my favorite. Happy 30th, boo. Welcome to... The end. Ha! Kidding. Kind of. Bye. Hey, let's find some better lighting here. Oh yes, much better. Anyways, Rachel, so excited to be here to celebrate your 30th birthday. And uh, thanks Bob and Jan for the free cocktails. Um, I think it's been, gosh, about four or five years since we've known each other. Um, that first day we met at Shady Lady. Um, and the years since then have involved massive amounts of vodka, um, many good times and a lot of laughs. Um, happy birthday, Rachel, I love you so much. And vajankles for life. If you don't know what that means, just Google it. Bye. I just wanna say thank you for uh inviting us to this celebration and you know it feels really special to us um, just to be included um, with this uh, event with these kind of great people and uh, what's that what we're we're not invited we're not invited hi Rachel for your birthday I thought that I would try to read as many facts about vodka in 30 seconds because you love vodka and you're turning 30 
and I love you. So my mother's going to time me on the count of three. One, two, three, go. Vodka can be used to kill bees. To relieve a fever, use a washcloth to rub vodka on your chest and back. Add a jigger of vodka to a 12-ounce bottle of shampoo. The alcohol cleanses the scalp, removes toxins from hair, and stimulates the growth of healthy hair. This one's my favorite. To remove red wine stains, spray vodka on the stains, scrub them with a brush, and then lick it dry. By the 19th century, many Russians were producing their own cheap homemade vodkas. Okay. This resulted in an epidemic of drunkenness throughout the country. Oh, and that's it. And my time's up. There's more where that came from, but Patrick won't let me have enough time to say all these fun facts. So in honor of your dirty 30, want to say cheers. We love you. And cheers. A Republican Jew exists? Is this person also a fan of Hitler? How do I know, Rachel? Well, we were brought together through our love of vodka, Trader Joe's mini chicken tacos, and fighting crime in the mean streets of East Sacramento. You see, it all started when someone stole the plants off my porch. And the final straw was someone took her bench, her whole fucking bench. That's when we formed the dynamic crime-fighting duo of Stoli and Hutch. We're all over Nextdoor.com. We fueled up on vodka, mini chicken tacos, and stumbled our way down to the community safety meeting at McKinley Park. Now, we don't know what the results of that meeting were because we ended up at the limelight before the meeting was over. But what we do know is that we can't stop, won't stop fighting crime until those criminals are brought to justice or until we run out of vodka, which is never because we have hella fucking vodka. So drink up, eat some fucking tacos, and let's hit the streets, Rachel. Happy birthday. Uh, and then we're kind of wrapping up here. You love going to ESAC bars. Unfortunately, you hang out with this guy. And that's probably why you don't have a boyfriend. So, in conclusion, those are just a few of the things that I think you like. Uh, happy 30th. Just remember one thing. Everybody hurts sometimes. And, gonna. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Rachel! Love you, boo! Drink all the vodka! Woo! Hi, Rachel. Happy birthday. It's your mom. Hey, honey, it's your dad. Happy birthday to you. Oh, and by the way, Zoom says you're the big star today. Glad you're celebrating with all your friends. Hope you're just having a wonderful time at your party. We love you very much. We want you to know you make us proud every single day. Very proud, Rachel. We love you, honey. I'll love you forever. For always I'll like you. As long as I'm living and beyond, my baby, you'll be. Mwah. Love you, toots, to pieces. Happy birthday, honey. <laughs>